Yes, sir. It's your boy B Hayes. We're back with another one, guys. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. Before we do that, watch out for spam, WhatsApp, and the comments down below. Feel free to join VIP to be alerted whenever we get in and out of plays. VIP been going crazy. Also, get your free stock in the description down below as well. So as we know, guys, we did it again. VIP, guys, all last week, the great plays. The week before that week, great plays. Uh, this week is going to be all great plays, but affirm what we got into on Friday. Open up, open the bill. We are already up, up, up over a thousand dollars. Made a thousand dollars with affirm today. As soon as we got out of that play, I already knew exactly where that money was about to go to next, the next location. As soon as we got out of it, and you know I hate to just talk about it, we could uh, be about it and show you guys the receipts. But anyway, as soon as we got to that play, it's just crazy because you made the thousand and then you move that money over to the next location. And as soon as you move it over to the next location, you already up a band again, just like that. So in the next play that we move over into, I'm looking to make, you know, a few thousand off of it, guys, because we already made like 10 bands off this play. Uh, probably more than 10 bands, probably like 12, 13,000 off this play a week or two ago, not last week, but the week before which I'm talking about Carvana, guys. You know that being my play, my bread and butter. I've been talking about it, talking about it, talking about it, talking about it, and nobody can't say I haven't. And why everybody else with bigger platforms told you not to buy it, I'm saying you better buy it because it's going to be one of the biggest printing money machines you could print. Because if that thing go ahead and do what, I, what it's supposed to do, man, look, that's all I'm going to say. I'm talking about you could turn $1,000 into 30, 40 bands. If if it move how we supposed to, how it's supposed to move, and you could turn ten bands into six figures, I'm talking two hundred, two hundred quarter million type jump. But anyways, that's a conversation for another day. Them figures hurt y'all brains, some of y'all brains, but some of y'all, like I say, some of y'all doing very well for yourselves or whatnot. Shout out to y'all. Some of y'all already got millions of dollars that uh that watch the channel, and you already know we all gonna be there though. But anyways, guys, as you know, uh. Let's go ahead and take a look at this, man, because things is about to heat up. And as you can see by the video title, guys, it's being confirmed. And I'm going to tell you guys exactly what I mean by confirmation and things have been confirmed. But before that, let's go ahead and show the receipt. As you guys can see right here, we have alerted. We have alerted uh, a firm on Friday right here said I bought or whatnot, we bought right there with Larry with Blase and Whoop. And you know, I wasn't up any money at this post. They got in exactly when I got in, right? And then on today, we sold a firm. And we said, we always say when we sell, because it's nothing with just buying and being up, you got to sell it. We sold a firm for 700 plus profit, and we bought and we sold for a couple hundred. And Robin Hood, which equals out to be $1,000, right? So I was like, alert this Friday, lots of money to be made, sheesh. And then I said, we got another play, just alerted uh, Carvana right after we sold out of net. When I say Carvana, I'm loaded up. I like, yeah, we about to blow up, hurry family, at 683. Imagine if you got it at that price, options. And it ended at 730, up 50 cents on the, uh, uh, just imagine, right? You'd have been up nicely because I already was able to sell mine. Not both though. Because like I said, I'm looking to make thousands off Carvana. Carvana. So I sold and we bull up 700 profit and I still hold it in my Robinhood account, guys. And I'm going to show you guys that as well. And I'm still holding in my Robinhood. What's that? Up 700 something in Robinhood. And you sold and we bull. That was just to lock in, just to stick to my system, stick to the stick to the strategy, you know what I mean? And I could always get back in. Like I end up getting back in on Webull. After I sold, I end up getting back in. So now I'm still currently holding in two positions. So for one position is up, the other one, I'm down probably $50 in Webull, which, you know, dropping the bucket. It don't really matter, guys. We'll be up tomorrow. And it's probably already up now because in after hours, once it continues to go up, options ain't priced in until the market hours, guys, normal market trading hours. But anyways, go ahead and get right into it, guys. Share with you guys. Let you guys know exactly what's been going on what's happening and all the great great stuff that's about to come our way as we know the nasdaq jumped two percent dow closes 250 points higher as investors weigh fed rate path so stocks roll monday as investors 
uh, contemplated a potential slowdown in interest rate hikes from the Federal Reserve and braced for a busy week of earnings. So as we know, guys, a lot, a lot of major companies are reporting earnings this week. And like I told you guys, it's going to be a major dictation on the overall market. I do expect earnings to be uh, fairly good for some of these companies because if we go by data research, which we load it back up with numbers and not just fairy tales, over 60% of the companies beat expectations this earnings season so far. So that's good to know, guys, right? So long as uh, inflation is cooling off, interest rates is about to become less aggressive, earnings is looking good, the economy is being more consumers, things is heating up for the market. That ain't nothing but a fucking recipe for a bomb to explode. Everything is going on, right? And then if we take a further look, we know shares of tesla and apple watch this gained on hopes that reopening in china will boost their businesses both big tech names recently grappled with temporary shutdowns and blows to production as the country dealt with surging covid 19 cases so that was in a, a rough patch until just recently guys as the reopening for china is about to send tesla and apple shares through the roof guys because you know it's going to uh, generate lots of business for them so uh earning reports would definitely keep markets on edge this week guys you know i love to tell you guys i could zoom out and tell you exactly what's going to happen with the market before it even happened last week it was artificial artificial this week i told you guys it had no choice but to run the way we ended on friday everything that was you know just it's so much information right but you guys get it but anyways uh this week we're looking to be very bullish at least three maybe three days out of the five one day maybe sideways a little choppiness but we should be bullish majority of the week right it is going to be a little on edge being for the fact that they have some control that they can use and leverage with earnings coming out we know how that loves to put his dictation on the market as well and you know slow the market down or make it uh have a little hiccup in it but anyways as long as the big businesses, majority of them can report solid earnings, it's going to be a great uh, favor in our favor for the market, the ones that's going long, guys. Like I say, though, man, we about to print so much money this week. It's about to be crazy. Options, uh, shares, outright, however you want to do it. You know, we're about to go uh, real, real crazy in VIP, guys. We're talking 300, 400, 500 percent days. And if Carvana does what we need to do, we're going to print psh, thousands of percentage in a single day. Watch it. Watch. And then when I show you guys the proof and show you guys the receipts, I'm going to be like, dang, he sure did said it. He sure did said it. Yeah. But yeah, guys, be prepared. Watch. Because uh, a small little band or two, because sheesh, what this bad boy about to do could make you a whole lot of money. I'm talking about life changing money. But you already know what to do, guys. Edge Bull on Instagram. But I need the market to do what it's supposed to do. You know, I can't make the market do nothing. That's why people say, oh, so how high you think it's going to go? Well, I know where it could go. I know where it possibly could go. But it's like, that's the least of my concerns for real. I'm focused on whatever the market is going to give me. Whatever the market give me, I'm going to take it. I can't. I know where it's going. But it's like, kind of defeats the purpose whenever you still got to go with the market. You get what I'm saying? So even though I know it's going here, it's kind of mine will just go i'm just alerted when i sell it and also you can know if you looking at it or been paying attention doing a homework a little bit or even trying to learn for yourself instead of just steady following someone's every move you will also be able to know and tell too by the whole nature of the the shift and the attitude of the stock it's going to let you know when it's done and that's what i mean i can give you a price where it's headed but I got to let the market do what it's do. I got to know what the price action. I all got to factor in all these things. So really my number or whoever number ain't gonna really matter. It's up to the market to decide. So that's the main thing you need to take away from everything and a lot of stuff, guys, is going with the flow, the ocean of the flow. However the market move, you move. So you already know what to do, guys. I love you. Edge Bull on Instagram at the BH Show. Get in VIP, do whatever you got to do. We out. God bless you.